So what is the num num uh, what is the second one? Second one is thousand twenty three. The first one is four thousand ninety six, and the second one is thousand twenty three. Those who wish to write down the note can write the note now. Okay, those who wish to write down the note can write this. So, but anyway, I'll I'll share this. But if you wish to write down, you can write. <coughs> okay. Uh, meanwhile, I'll do the. I'll also calculate this and try to find the answer. I'm going to convert four thousand ninety-six to binary. Okay, I'm going to convert four thousand ninety-six to binary, and this will give you interesting answer. Let's see whether you have found the answer. Four thousand ninety-six. So four thousand ninety-six divided by two is equal to. So those who here can answer equal to two thousand and forty-eight. Two thousand forty-eight. Two thousand forty-eight. And remainder is nothing remains. Remainder zero. Yeah. Then two thousand forty-eight divided by two is equal to thousand twenty-four. Remainder zero. And you have to repeat the step. Uh, sir, one question. Yes. Sir, if you uh, if you get uh, uh, like point five point one something like that, mm. how do you do it? That's why I said not to convert to fractionals, integers only. Apni mehmi tamu. We have seventeen marks. We have some seventeen marks with us. I am asking you to divide it to two groups with equal size. Marks da ha tak te na marks. I mean, that let's say you have seventeen tennis balls. I am asking you to divide it to two equal groups. Ito ro kahum do abedan. Seventeen tennis balls or seventeen marks. Eighteen point. Eight point. Eight. Can I? Can I go to mark bar? Mark bar. Then I'll see. Can I go? Are you going to do half mark to some no. mark? Ah, uh, that that cannot. That's why integers. Think about integers, whole numbers. Don't think about the fractions. You you are going to divide by eight by eight. So one group group A will get eight. The second group will also get eight. There will be one remainder. That is for you. You can keep it. So next time, that eight you are going uh, going to divide it to two, two groups, four by four. Then remain is zero. You are you have nothing. Then that that four you are going to divide by two, that is two. Then remain is zero. Again, two divide by two is one. You have two marks. Divide it to two people, or divide it to two groups. Each group will get one, and you will get zero. So don't think about the fractional part. If you think about fractional part, you can't do this. So because this is dealing with integers only, no fractions, no decimals. Lashama, it gava ganne pa. Meke di veda karan na pi integer ekka vitara. I mukha the number system meka convert karadi. Integer part taka me vidira convert karan. But fractional part you have separate mechanism, right? Okay, sir. Thank you. Okay, fractional part you have separate mechanism. Okay, now now you have to divide this. Uh, four thousand ninety-six divided by two is two thousand forty-eight. Remain the zero. Two thousand forty-eight divided by two is thousand twenty-four. Remain the zero. Then thousand twenty-four. Thousand. Five hundred twelve remain the zero. Five hundred twelve remain the zero. Then five twelve. Two hundred fifty-six remain the zero. Two hundred fifty-six remain the zero. Two five six. One hundred twenty-eight remains zero. Yes, great. So then repeat. Let's repeat. One hundred twenty-eight. 
32 remainder 0. Then you have 32. And that 16 remainder 0. 16 remainder 0. Okay, let's repeat. Few to go. Okay, then. 8 remainder 0. Yeah, 32, 64 again here. 16 divided by 2 is 8. Remain. 8 remainder 0. 8 uh, divided by 2 is 4 remainder 0. 4 divided by 2 is 2 remainder 0. 2 divided by 2 is 1 remainder 0. Now you can see all these bits are in binary. Only zeros and ones. When you get zeros and ones, you have to write down. 1, how many zeros? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 12 zeros. 12 zeros. 11, 12. All together, 12 zeros. That is this number. 4096 is 1 and then how many zeros? 12 zeros. But there's, there's an easy way. There's an easy way. Uh, I'll, I'll explain easy way later. Because uh, let's do in the difficult way first. Then only we can learn. There, there are enough, there are very uh, easy or the shortcuts. But forget about shortcuts. Let's uh, do according to the mechanism. Then about 1023. 1023. Let's do the same thing. Divide by 2. What is the value? 511 remained 1. 511. Eleven. Yeah, let's repeat. So now this is going to be a headache. <laughs> but this is not going to divide this. Always it will give us one, no? Isn't that? So here. Yes, five, five. Um, uh, some places it is. Uh, See, 255 remained one. 255. 255. Yeah. 67 of it. 127. Yeah. Uh, 127 remainder. Then 127. It is 63. 63. When you have 63, the value is 31. 31. 31. Then you get 31. Then the value is 15. 15. Okay, let's think about 51. 51, uh, sorry, 15 divided by 2 is 7 remains seven. 1. Then 7 divided by 2 is 3. 3 remains 1. And 3 divided by 2 is 1 remains 1. 1 remains 1. This is. <coughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. How many ones? How many ones? Yes? 10, 1. 10, 1. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 ones. Okay, this is the binary number. So now you know how to convert number to a binary. Decimal things, you don't think about decimal points. We will learn that there's another mechanism to convert decimal points. Dashama Sankhya Valata, Tava Tramayat, Tienama. Abe me panthe di apeke ganagan no one. Apeke is Sarha Pantheke di ganagamu. Kamathinan nikang hoela balan internet again, but that is not required. Hari, let's do, let's convert to some other number system. These are the two answers. Metandi balan ekak varadun moka de vene. All other answers will be wrong. You will get all wrong answers after that. Right? If you get one here, accidentally, if you got one, accidentally, then all these answers will be wrong. So that is the nature of binary calculation. Okay, anyway, now we know how to calculate or how to convert to binary. Let's give another, I'll, I'll give another number, 34. Uh, 34 in decimal. <laughs> Can you convert this to octal? Can you convert this to octal? Can. How? Uh, 
Dividing by 8. Yeah. 2 octal means, octal number system means, you know, base 8. Base 8. If base A is A, base is 8, the mechanism is, you have to divide 34 by 8, then write the value, it is uh, 4. 4. And remainder is 2. 2. Then you know all the numbers are now in octal, no? 4 and 2 both are in octal. You can write like 42 in octal. That is how you can do it. Uh, Confused? If you get... Uh, yeah, confused. Uh, uh, they, uh, let, uh, tell me the answer first. Four, 34 divided by 8. Are you agree it is 4? 32, uh, 34 divided by 8? Is it 4? Uh, excuse me, sir. Yeah. Just tell me. Yes, sir. 32, uh, 32, 34. Excuse 30. me, sir. Yeah, yeah. Tell me, tell me. Sir, how? Uh, sir, it's better if you give you uh, give us a bigger number. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Other I than that. Yeah, yeah, next one I'll give a bigger number. That's why I know you confuse because of a small number. I know that. I'll give a bigger one. Right. 34. 34. What is the number of 34? 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 4, 2, kena dekama, you can see both numbers are valid numbers in octal. Here, in, let me go to octal. And these are the octal numbers. Octal numbers, here 4 is valid octal number. 2 is also valid octal number. That's why I stopped from that level. Okay, let me give a big number. Then you will understand this very well. I'll give some bigger number. And for an example, okay. Let's say you have 5 to L in decimal. Now you want to convert this to octal. How you are going to convert? Can you start converting? Divide by 8. Yeah, divide by 8. Okay, Let, let's divide by 8. 5 to L divide by 8. So now this is a little bit hard, but tell me the answer. 5 to L divide by 8. 5 to L. Pahata ateva ne. Panas ekata ateva. Kid. Haya ine. That one. Haya hatalis atai. There panas ekata ateva. Hayak tinitritu nitis dekata ateva. Hatarai. Sir, I found the answer. Okay. Wait, ta. wait till. Okay. I know, I know. <laughs> I know there are some extraordinary students who can find even answer before, even before I write the question. <laughs> so I know that. <laughs> so that's great. <laughs> that's really great. But this is, these are easy things. Huh? These are easy things. So uh, let's wait. Let's wait for others because we have to go with others. Because we, as, we learn as a team now. You know, we have to wait till the teammates. So then only, uh, because I know people, a lot of people are success as individuals, but when they are working in real teams, they fail. Think about Sri Lankan cricket team. Sri Lankan cricket team, they don't have to do a field. They don't have to do a field. But ultimately, as a team, they are going to fail. Because of that uh, holes. So let's wait for others, huh? for the moment. But I'll give you the chance. But this is learning pace. No? Let's give chance to others. For the moment, okay? Don't worry. Don't be upset. I know that you are good. You are talented. That's great. You can lead others. But let's wait for others. Okay. Uh, then, uh, what is the answer? It's remainder zero. Then, 64 divided by 8. 8. Yeah, it is 8. 8. 8 remainder. Again, zero. 0. So, is, uh, are these uh, valid numbers? Zero is valid number. Zero is valid number. Eight is it a valid octal? Eight. Yes. No. Yes, sir. Eight. Yes, yes, sir. No, no. No, no, no. Eight is not a valid octal. Here it will go up to seven. 
0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 only. Not 8 is not there. Right? 8 is not there. It's varied up to 7. Therefore, you have to divide this again. 8 divided by 8. It is... Yes? 1, one remainder one. 0. Then what is the value? 1, 0, 0, 0 in octal. So if you found that answer, tell me how many of you found that? 1, 0, 0, 0. Ah, it seems all. Right. 2, 3. Yes, 3 have found the answer. That's great. So next time what you can do is you can just paste it to chat. Then I know that you have found the answer before others. Then because voice I cannot find. It is one zero 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 in octal. Correct. So let me show the importance of this. IAP may number systems me So let's uh, move to this one. I'm going to browse something. Let me show this. Excuse me, sir. Yeah. Sir, how did one come to the front? This one. One zero. No, sir. Yeah. Then. One zero 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 eight. That thing. Yeah, yeah. This is one zero zero zero. You start from this and go forward. One zero zero zero. Eight divided by eight is one remainder zero. Here also you got that. One, likewise, you climbed. Started started with one, then you climbed. Here also you got you got like that, no? Make in tama patangat. Mithanat make in tama patangat. Mithanat mithanin mithanin patangin udate ani me udate ani hambu inne udate ani kali mu uttare na me. Hatarai dekai dem uda mugut na. Ehin de tani mu uttare. Mithan ekem patangin ata udate. Okay, this is the importance. So you can see this is. This is a level paper, December 2018. The first question, in which form is data and instruction stored in the computer? What is the answer? Data is stored in binary. binary. Yeah, it's binary. It's binary. Not binary. binary. Yeah, this is all level paper. That's why I said. So if you learn this time, over the earlier days, all level, all the tip, sorry, grade six, seven, eight, all the IT tip, bina kali. Now, even you can answer all level papers, but don't think that you can answer all level paper just uh, in uh, maybe after three years, all level paper will be different than this because this is too easy. Then it's asking octal of this one, 156 in octal. So you can do that as well. Then it is asking which is here in 800. Is it a decimal? Valid in dec decimal 800? Yes, 8 is valid decimal. Is it valid in decimal in and hexadecimal? Both? Decimal yes. hexadecimal? Yes, it's valid. Decimal and octal? No, octal you no. don't have 8. Octal only? No, octal you don't have no. 8. So the answer is 2. So likewise, it's easy to find the answer for that as well. Okay, with that I'll stop. So just go and see the paper 2018-19. Maybe you can answer a few questions in MCQ. Okay, with that, I'll stop for today. I'm thinking of increasing the time as suggested, but uh, first let me organize my schedules, right? First let's, let me organize my schedules. It will take, the, in January, most of my classes will be over. After that, I will uh, arrange, rearrange this for one and a half sessions, one and a half hour sessions. So that is my plan anyway. We have to wait till January. So now we have like 10 students here. We will we have to fill the class to 50, 25. Someone in class, I got 25, 30. So we'll in January. So we'll to in 25. Then we'll uh, increase the time. But a bit of a call in a gang in a minute. Join in a meet. Okay, with that, I'll stop. So then, thank you very much. Good night. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Goodbye. Bye.